It's uh, Tuesday, Adams. Taylor, are you listening to me? I need you to watch my videos, please. Um, I was going to do... I was going to do some fine feature film, but I'm not doing it right now because um, I filed a missing persons report. Um, I filed a kidnapping charge. Look, they're kidnapping you. Um, I, I called the Douglas Pl uh, Sheriff's Department. Um, I called uh, Channel 3 News. I left a report. Um, I called... Uh, is that it? Um... Oh, I called the Newman Chief, Dixie. Um, it's about 5.30 in the morning. Um, today is um, the 27th, I think. It's Thursday. It might be the 28th. Um, there's something wrong with this apartment. Look at my eyes. Okay, I've been sleeping in the bedroom. The lo the landlord came out and kicked the door open. I paid the rent. I've been paying the rent since I since you guys left. Um, you do you know it's been almost three months. You said you'd come back and get me, remember? And I texted you. I told him. I told you, stay away until I get somebody put in jail for this. Okay, well I got an eviction notice. Um, on Sunday, so I, I mean, I have already been called, I already missed, uh, filed the kidnapping report, the human trafficking report, um, the, um, uh, missing persons report, okay, um, you're 30 years old, your birthday is next week, well, I mean, two weeks, in two weeks, your birthday is in two weeks, um, they kidnapped you just to jump you. I heard that. They're just going to jump you. Watch your back. Okay. They kidnapped you just to jump you. Okay. Um, I got some. I got some investigation reports. I'm going to do a. Um, I'm going to request an investigation. Because and I've got an. I've got um. Your dad's in prison. Okay. He's a meth manufacturer, gun toting drug dealer. And he kidnapped you. Your girlfriend's uncle is a lawyer. And I don't even know his name. There's a lawyer in control of this. That person has to lose their license to practice law. Because this is illegal. Okay. Parental alienation is illegal. If they kidnapped you and told you that you're having sex with your mom and you're not, that's fucking crazy. You can't blame beer. Okay. That's illegal. It's illegal. And it's deception, it's kidnapping, it's abuse, it's fraud, it's theft, I mean, criminal confinement. This is fucking ridiculous. All to avoid a lawsuit because of the Aryan Brotherhood thing. They are affiliated with your father. Um, there's a motorcycle gang out here called Stone Cold. And uh, what are they? Fucking Stone Cold. That is Stone Fucking Cold. I, I mean, you guys left me here stranded. I don't have any transportation. You took my fucking truck. And I don't have you cut your foot. Or your phone got disconnected, so I can't save your life again. This is the second time this has happened. I cannot save your life. You have to do this on your own. You have to find a phone. If you can't call me, it's because you don't have my number. Somebody busted your phone again. Did they jump you and bust your phone? Look, oh my God. That's just, that's what they did to Billy. That's exactly what they did to Billy. And Billy's in prison serving 15 years. Okay, I have not seen Dustin. For 16 years. Okay. I don't know if he's uh, dead or alive. The last picture I saw of him. They knocked his tooth out. Okay. He looks like a little boy. He's fucking 36 years old. He's skinny as hell. And his hair is being neglected. He's being neglected and abused. These kids are kidnapped. Uh, pay attention to me. 
His dad is a millionaire, okay? They are fucking using money to pay the lawyers and the police to put the power on the wrong side on purpose. Oh, my God. So, anyway, listen. This is a violation of my rights. Um, I paid the rent. She gave me a receipt from August. It's from July to August. And then on the 23rd, on Sunday, she came out and gave me three days to notice to vacate and said I owed it. Seven hundred forty-eight, forty-five dollars I told her, I said, you know, I can't do that. I ain't got no money. Nobody will hire me. They're trying to control my money, my income. Trying to tell me what to do, violate my rights, trying to take my rights away. I told him, I said, you know what, that little check, fucking take it. But you've got to give me the right to work. You can't take away my right to work. So I reported three of the businesses here, three of the five businesses here. No, I mean, three of the six. There's six businesses here. Okay, and I put my application in at all six. Three of them have abused me. One of them became violent, physically violent, and I reported that too. Over beer. One beer. One beer. One. Two dollar beer. What's that? Two dollar whore? Oh, that's funny. And then you're not going to buy me, you're not going to let me borrow money Um, since I, you know, even though I could pay you back, you're not going to let me borrow money for beer on Mother's Day, which I had to sit here alone. That's abusive. Because why? Because they said you had sex with me or you did something to me when you were 12 years old. Are you fucking serious? I'm not like that. You're not like that. I'm not a sex offender. You're not a sex offender. What the fuck? It was about the KKK sheet that the black lady dressed you up in at YOC. They kidnapped you and I never seen you since. And your dad's lawyer's been trying to kill me ever since. Because it's a goddamn lawsuit. Okay? We have to have the money to raise our kids and grandkids and to build walls and to pay them to fight the right side of the, on the right side of the law and put the power back on the right side. Come on. They kidnapped you to jump you. That's what they did to Billy. And Billy can't even speak anymore. Come on. Dustin lost his tooth. Come on. I know your dad whipped you to death and told you what to say. I can tell. She's the one I chose. Okay, and you're scared to fucking death. You can walk on ain't shells. You can't even fucking breathe. You don't make any decisions of your own. Somebody else is in complete control. And if you don't do what they tell you to, they're going to whoop your ass, right? I know. I can see it in your fucking eyes. I can hear it in your voice. I can see it in the way you act. That's abuse. That's kidnap. That's criminal confinement. And nobody wants to take me seriously. It's not your choice. And I know it's not. And they're forcing you to say it is, aren't they? I know they are. I can tell. Because that's not what you want. This is not what you want. You're not even allowed to see your granddaughter. She's white blonde. They're going to kidnap her too. I can see him making plans. Look, your dad's dad, your grandfather, Bruce Hatfield, has done it twice already. Three times because of you. Okay? He kidnaps blondes, little blonde girls, because he's a fucking pervert. Okay? And he disables them. He kidnaps blondes and disables them. And he's affiliated with the white brotherhood. White area, white, white percent uh, supremacists. The white supremacists, okay? That's why the black lady attacked you. You didn't even ask for it. You didn't even do nothing wrong, honey. You were punished for something you didn't fucking do to yourself. Okay, they're punishing you because of who your dad is, who the grandfather is. It doesn't have nothing to do with me or you. Okay, those white supremacists are violent. They're meth manufacturers over here. There's real anhydrous. This is farmlands. Corn and beans. Okay, they use real anhydrous here. The, bitch, the shit is real here. I don't know. Okay, and then up here, and I'm I'm not doing it. I promise you, I'm not. I'm not done anything wrong. 
since I've been here, except to drink beer. Okay, <clears throat> and, and they can't hit me over that. They can drug test me to do anything. But look, my eyes are red. Do you know why? I've been sleeping in the bedroom. Okay, something's wrong. They've got a lot of asbestos lawsuits over here. People are not living in their host houses. They've been moving in into the garages because it's that fucking bad here. I can't even walk down to the gas station without snot running down my nose. I know that's disgusting. Okay, but my allergies are killing me. I can barely breathe. Okay, so if I do get thrown out, I'm not going to argue. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and go. Okay, but I might, I'm probably going to, I'll probably, uh, I don't know, I might go to Chicago. Or I, I doubt that I will go to Paris. Okay, um, but uh, I might go to Paris. I don't know, but um, I'd rather I'd rather go. I probably I don't know what I'm gonna do. I need to go to college. Okay, so that's my issue is I want to go to college. But please, God damn it, listen to me. Don't let them jump you. Don't get violent. Don't do any drugs. Don't do anything wrong. I know they're being Hitler to you. <laughs> okay, they're being Hitler to me too. You can't do nothing. I gotta be the perfect mother of Jesus Christ. <laughs> you gotta be Jesus Christ in order to be accepted in their fucking circle and they can do anything they want. They do meth, they make meth, carry guns, you know, and you know, they're allowed to do anything they want and you're, you have to be a fucking perfect angel. Those, those are the hell's angels, honey. Those are hell's angels. That's who we are. But they don't like us. <laughs> okay. Okay, don't do nothing wrong. Be an angel. We got to keep the power on our side, and um, we've got to fight for our rights. We live in America. This is what our soldiers live for, fight for, and die for. The rights. That's what this is about. They violated our rights. Parental alienation is illegal. Okay. <clears throat> I love you.